Greetings everyone. Today we are going to talk about is Purina better than Yelan and Kokomi. Before starting, I have a few things to say. First, I am comparing these three characters to understand which one is the most free to play and is best for Spider Levis and your team compositions. Lastly, I am not biased because Yelan is my favorite character, but I am still going to give my honest reaction based on their skill kits. Vocalers can be used as both a sub DPS and a healer. In most of the team composition, Vocalers is very easy to use character. And this is why it is worth the try and risk of 50 50. But in the other hand, as I said before, Kokomi and Yelan is a known character. Both of them are good in Spiral Abyss. Yelan's works best as a sub DPS if combined with a pyro DPS like Hutao or uh, what? Yoimiya, Yoimiya, okay. If combined with Hutao or Yoimiya, she works even better. My Yelan used to deal 10k damage with Yoimiya, but I think she is better with Hutao. But actually, you can use Yelan as a main DPS as well with characters sub as Xiangling or Bennett plus an animal like Kazuha. And if you don't have Kazuha, that's alright, you can use a different kind of animal character. Like Linette also works fine. To be honest, Purina is just a combined version of Kokomi and Yelan. And as you know, Yelan is mainly a sub DPS. Most people use her as a sub DPS and most people use Kokomi as a healer. And Purina is just both, sub DPS and a healer. As a free player, I will recommend you to go for Furina if you need a Hydro Healer plus DPS, I mean sub DPS. And Furina can also buff, which is an extra advantage if you take Furina into your team. But if you go for like Yelan plus Kokomi, you will have to pull for both characters and this is kind of annoying. Ultimately, it's up to you for who you like and who you want. You can select a character you want. My work is to bring you the news and how one character works so you can plan better for your future. Thank you guys for watching this video. See you next time.